Welcome back to Crusader Kings 3, a game of thrones. We're back with our Dane playthrough and we have some war to do today. Oh dear. Uh, at the end of the last episode, the Reach have now declared war against my liege for the High Lordship of Blackmont, uh, which is actually our territory. We own this. Currently, the Tyrells are already here uh, and my liege is in the north. So we're going to join up with them. But first, I have something a little bit more important to deal with. We need to find my son... A wife and I think we're going to abandon the whole Baratheon idea just because it, it's too tedious to figure out they don't want to join my court even after I gave Clifford a bribe so let's just go ahead and abandon this we're actually going to go ahead and break this betrothal as well what's the the downside of doing this I wonder we just lose some opinion okay that's fine oh the Danes lose opinion on me as well I'm not too bothered let's go ahead and break this betrothal so she's open for an alliance in the future and then with my my player Aaron's son I found an ally close by on the Westerlin border we're gonna ally ourselves with the high lordship of Craycall and I think it's you here Sylvina Craycall look at that she's hail she's diligent as well she's got nice stewardship nice uh, diplomacy nice prowess so maybe she would be a good match for my son so let's go ahead and arrange the marriage they will accept which is fortunate because we have too many existing alliances it's actually hard to try and find some marriages but we're going to go ahead and send off the proposal hopefully we can get some allies in the westerlands now we need to go ahead and raise our men too are we actually ready to raise them no we're still replenishing so let's go on speed four and we'll just quickly replenish some of our men at arms to the Serene Ulrich, I gladly accept your betrothal proposition. Your son and heir, Allard, we've been betrothed to my sister, Sylvina. Excellent. I like that name as well, Sylvina. Sound, it sounds quite nice. It rolls off the tongue nicely. What's this? You want military power. Oh, that's Harren Hall. Okay, I doubt anyone's going to join them, though. Uh, we became the new dynasty ahead as well. Uh, we're fighting to become dynasty head it's back and forth back and forth there we go <laughs> we've lost it again already right we've replenished the men so let's go ahead and raise the armies who do we want commanding the armies i wonder master reynold here is a flexible leader and a rough terrain expert he seems like the obvious choice so let's let him lead the army it's gonna take five months to raise the men really wait what happened here my brother morris dane died he died from his wounds. He died in battle. So we've lost some alliances there as well. And we've lost a councillor member. My spy master. Okay, do we have anyone that can take over? I do. In fact, my cousin, Carole here, she's an okay spy master. And she's a powerful vassal. So let's go ahead and make her my spy master. Hopefully she likes me a little bit more now. Uh, and we're going to go ahead and raise the men here. Aren't we focusing on intrigue? We are wife would you like to help me with intrigue oh you're not very good at it are you i think at the moment we're fabricating hooks uh okay we're trying to murder the baratheons wasn't it we're gonna lose land as well oh she has to be a managed domain okay i remember this now <laughs> i've been out of it my hay fever has been absolutely uh butchering me over the last week or so three months left to raise the men that's not too lost we've lost a siege as well hopefully they don't come south and interfere wait what are you guys at 1000 men are you guys coming south as well or is this just a, a, a yolo charge there the twist and turns of fate have not always been to my advantage the seven who are one knows that i was cursed the day i met lord martin today however that curse has been lifted fate has smiled upon me and brought that worthless knave to his grave he died from a heart failure not one day too soon either <laughs> If they attack us here, could we win? Oh dear, what have you done? You you have worse battle strategy than I do. And that's saying something. Today my daughter Nicolette was taught a lesson in vassal management by Fallon. So she's forgiving. Okay, we'll let her be forgiven. I like to let my children just kind of shape themselves naturally. This is under siege now as well. How long left? 28 days until we've raised the men. So only one more month. We have 1500 gold. I might buy some mercenaries in fact before we leave here. Let's go ahead and raise everyone. My acquaintance, Alara, di Alara Baratheon, died in her sleep. Okay, I think that's just old age. Oh, you died as well. We we've lost the, the Hightower alliance. Oh, we're losing all of our alliances. Okay. What about mercenaries? We can recruit a lot of mercenaries. Look at that. The Sand Dornish Band of White Dunes. We get some outriders, some light horsemen, and some crossbowmen. I think I will recruit these guys. That's basically all of our gold, but that's fine. Let's go ahead and hire them. 
<laughs> oh dear, that's crazy. We now have 15,000 men. I don't think that's enough to fight these guys by us. Yeah, not even close. We have 29,000 compared to their 27,000. I don't think I can invite any allies to the war either because it's not my war. We can demand payment if we need it. Ah, it doesn't matter though. My allies are arriving. Right, let's go ahead and march up the road. I'm going to go on three times speed as well. Because this is where uh, precision is really going to matter. In fact, dare I even go to two times speed? We really want to win this war. Actually, let's go back up to three times. It's too slow, Ivo. <laughs> Ivo. We make our way up around Blackmont. We should be able to siege back some of his territory. Maybe even get in a fight. If I start a fight here, I wonder whether my allies will help me out. We would win, it says. We're in home territory. As long as they join us, I think we can win this. Let's see if we can get them to join in the battle. That would be very useful. Of course, these guys are much closer, so they're going to reinforce sooner. Are you going to join me? It doesn't look like it. Oh, dear. We might have messed up. Oh, my God, you have been so brave, so strong. Words cannot describe my love for you. And now we have a perfect daughter. What shall we call you, my... And she's hale. Very nice. I'm going to call you Jane. Don't I already have a daughter called Jane? I don't know. Arabella. There we go. May you go strong and wise. That's a bit more unique. And I will go ahead and pin you so we can sort out your education in the future. I don't think our allies are going to be joining us. However, we might actually still be able to do the heavy lifting and win this one. This is absolutely insane. I want a promotion after this. Ah, there we go. My son has come of age as well. So can he marry off yet? Not currently. Oh, I can negotiate. Let's get an alliance with you. There we go. That's fine. We can't marry them off yet because uh, the betrothed, the other party is too young. Greetings, my serene leader. I'm honored by your request and I'll be glad to call you an ally. Marvelous news. We captured a prisoner as well. How much are you worth? 100 gold even. Who? Look at that. Fallon is consistently pulling his weight. Fallon doesn't have any children though and he's not going to. I would want to give him land. But unfortunately, he's. it just doesn't look like he's going to have children. So he would lose it anyway. Let's go back. I mean, you guys are sieging this back. Look at that. We're, we're winning the war a little bit. Should we go into their territory? Let's go into their territory and maybe we can start sieging some of their castles. There we go, Yunus. I, I want a promotion for that. We're still earning a lot of gold as well. This war should be relatively easy. Uh, Dawn is becoming a new superpower in the Seven Kingdoms. How long? Four months to siege this. That's not too bad either, in fact. So let's go ahead with that plan. You've taken this back. Our oh, West Roost here still needs retaken back. Do you guys want to do that? Or are you just going to sit there? I think they're just going to sit there. It looks like these guys are coming back for round two as well. 21,000 men. I think we... Let's pull out of there, actually. I'm not confident fighting in their territory. Although it looks like they caught us that way. Oh, dear. <laughs> are we going to win this one? We should win this. Oh, our knight was wounded. Faction disbanded vote. At least some good news. Let's go ahead and speed things up a little bit. It looks like we were able to win by the skin of our teeth. We might have to go south and replenish again, though. And we gained a level of fame. We're now exalted among men. Oh, Lord Kennedy was... Wait, but he's... Oh, he's in Harrenhal. That's good. That's why the faction disbanded. It was all part of the plan. Do not worry. What I'm going to do... Oh, we need to take this back as well. Why, why are you just sat there? Take back the other castles, damn it. <laughs> Sometimes the AI is a little bit silly. Yeah, two months to take this back. That's fine. And they're going to come and attack me as well. Are you going to reinforce? No, you're just going to sit there. Of course you are. Wow. So you don't want to help? You have 8,000 men there ready to help? No? Okay. Oh, and now you want to go and siege that. Okay beautiful stuff. And my uncle was imprisoned. Wow. We've been betrayed on this day. Allard has come to me with an unusual request. His knight has died, leaving him without someone to... Ah, oh, no! Your knight died? Ah, that's frustrating. You're stubborn and brave. I... Oh, you're lazy. I don't think... Oh, and you're only a skilled... To... And you're a drunkard. Okay, I don't think he would have become... Yeah, he's not going to become. He can't wield Dawn anyway. I mean, I'll take you as my squire, but... We failed. 
how you died in battle was slain by Lord Albard of the Shield Islands. My counselor died as well. Ah, oh, this is terrible news. We need a new hand. I mean, my son can be my hand now. Where Where is my son? There he is. Let's go ahead and make my son my hand. Uh, let's go ahead. I mean, we can. Let's go ahead and increase this. Why not? Let's defend Starfall. Just make sure it's secure. Uh, we can train him. Let's go ahead and train him. I'm going to train him in strategy. Why not? We can change your contract as well. Let's get some more gold flowing. We can declare. Let's not declare war on you. Ah, why did they not help us? Damn it. Disappointing training session as well. You're already drunk. You only just turned 16. What is my son doing? <laughs> oh, what an episode. My Marshal Lucas has been showing off a promising new recruit. He may not be as noble stock as you, my liege. But on my name, I swear that Sebastian is someone you would want on your side. Is he now? I mean, he has got 14 Marshal, 14 press. Do you know what? He, he can serve me. Let's go ahead and invite him to my court. And now look, they're, they're fighting by themselves. And now they're definitely going to lose. Ugh. If they just came and helped me, maybe we'd be in a different position right now. But I guess that's in the past. Was it an excellent training session? There we go. At least my son has learned a bit more. Let's go ahead and take ourselves back to Starfall. I mean, I don't think there's much more we can do in this war now. We can't invite allies because it's not my war. We got a new intrigue perk. Why don't we go for murder scheme? And then what we can do... I have a plan. You're the leader of this. Why don't we murder him? It's not very high chances. But what we could also do is abandon this stuff. Yeah, let's abandon this. We can invite people even as well. You could be convinced. For how much? 137 gold. I will accept for now. And you want 150. I can't afford that. But what I can do is if I can find his spy master. His food taster. Okay, that would be a good one. If we fabricate a hook on you. We can. Oh, I'm so stupid. I forgot that because my ugh, we don't have intrigue hand, so we can't have two schemes. And now I just wasted the murder scheme. Ah, oh, damn it. Is it really gone? Yeah, I can't murder him until ugh, another 10 years. <laughs> this is terrible. I blame the sun and the hay fever. It's absolutely almost killed me this week. I almost didn't upload today. I'm recording today and uploading today. That's how cutthroat it's been. I wasn't able to record the last few days. It's fine. We're just going to have to roll the losses. Usually the downward trends offer some good comeback stories. Let's just keep training and strategy. Oh, another disappointing training session. What are you doing, son? So are you just going to charge back in like that? Can you not make some alliances yourself? Like, invite some allies. We need people to help us. Have I replenished it? I haven't replenished it. I'm going to wait until I replenish my men at arms. And then I will return north and try and siege some places. But yeah, it, it's not looking good. It looks like we're gonna, might, we might lose us. To be in place of Ulrich, I would like for your son and heir, Allard, to become the squire of Harmon. Okay, is he a good knight? Yeah, he's okay. Do you know what? I'll do it, though, because I don't want to be constantly clicking. Okay, I need a new castle now. Now maybe we go for Intrigue. My cousin, you're already my spy master. My knight? You're going to become my new castellan for now. And we can get some hostile schemes. What I might be able to do. Do you have any children? You don't have any allies, either. I could murder his children. <laughs> Murder his wife, and then he can remarry for an alliance. Let's start murdering his children. Why not? So we have both of those going on. We can even invite people to this. How much gold? 137 gold. Let's invite him. There we go. We're going to get revenge against the Reach. We might not be able to win the war, but we can definitely end their lineage. I'm proud to see my daughter no longer as a child, but as an adult. Right, so Adela, she can now marry off. Right, so let's go ahead. Wait, can you? No, because you're only 14. Okay, we'll let you guys carry on then. We'll marry off in the future. My uncle was taken prisoner as well. Oh, dear. I mean, if they attack us here, I think we should be fine. But they're not... The, the, the AI isn't stupid. Well, when it's the enemy, the AI aren't stupid. Faction created against Yenis as well. Oh, dear. 
We're entering a troubled time. Okay, I have my men at arms again. I wonder, should I come through here? Maybe I can start sieging some of these castles. That should at least help us a little bit of war score. Our war led by Lady Paramount Eunice of Dawn against Lord Paramount Talbot of the Reach ended inconclusively. Oh, so... It's fine. We won the war! <laughs> I don't know what's happening. I'm so confused. Let's just... Um, pause, pause. So everything's back to normal. As normal as things can be. Okay, right. In that case, I want to focus up here on Harren Hall because some of you suggested that we take this and then maybe give it to a family member and give them independence, which I would agree with. Some of you also said take it for myself, but I don't like that idea because I don't want to own land here and up here. It just doesn't seem like... Uh, it just doesn't seem right. I, I want all my holdings to be close by. I'm never going to march all the way up here just to visit Harren Hall. Uh, and another suggestion I like is we slowly conquer lands and connect the two and then surround the reach. Maybe we have a long-term grudge against the reach now. That could be something. But I think... Oh, look at you. You're four years old. I can revoke your title and I can take Harren Hall now. And it's not an act of tyranny because I have a claim. He won't accept it, though. But we can try it. And then I have to decide who to give Harren Hall to. To my liege, I see no choice but to bow to your decision. Okay, he gave me Harren Hall. Just like that. Whilst we... Can we restore Harren Hall? I don't think we can, right? I don't think that's in the game yet. But uh, we also have a claim on something else. What do we also have a claim on? Ah, this here. We have a claim on the city. Can I revoke your title here? I can. He's not going to accept it, but we're going to send the order anyway, and then we're going to take his title. Look at that, the model of Harren Hall. Uh, to my liege, blessings upon you and your house. It seems that there was no recourse for a dispute. Other than the seller on the battle fit upon found. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> Rally the men, guys. Let's go ahead and put a banner up here on Harren Hall. And then we can raise our armies here. We'll have the same commander. Uh, but look at that. The models in this game are absolutely formidable. I've said it before and I'll say it again. I, I really, really do like the attention to detail. Right, let's raise the men. This should be a very, very quick war. We won't need to call allies to the war, I don't think. 17 days left to raise the men. This should be over quick. And I need to think who to give Harren Hall to. I could give it to my son. Do I let my son rule some lands uh, and train ready to take over Starfall possibly we could make it so that the son and heir uh, is always in control of Harren Hall kind of like for the Targaryens how the heir always has Dragonstone that could be something let's go ahead and take the city I might do that I like the idea but I'm not going to give him independence then look at that we killed two of the champions as well it would be a bit silly to give him independence in that case so I'll keep the, the duchy title for myself when the time comes, my agents will need a safe escape route out of Lord Talbot's castle. Should anything go wrong, let's ask Lanessa, my friend. She's going to map it out. We're going to get revenge against the Tyrells. We're going to murder them and their children. And look at that. We've already won the war. Let's go ahead and enforce our demands then. To my liege, blessings upon you and your house. I know when I am defeated, it seems I am left with no choice but to comply with your demands. So be it. <laughs> okay. So we have... No, we need to revoke it again, don't we? I'm going to revoke this now. But this is a city, right? Yeah, this is... No. Oh, it's not a city. It's a castle. Okay. I thought it was a city. Maybe it was county and I misread it. See, the heat's getting to me. <laughs> oh, dear. So we need to give this... I could give this to my son as well. However, I my nephew here... Possibly. Let's go Dane. Let's go Dynasty Dane. And we'll go by age. Yeah, oldest. Who doesn't have land. Yeah, it's going to be my nephew. So my nephew, you're going to get the Lordship of Ferry Bridge. There we go. And then my son, I'm going to give you Harren Hall. This could lead to some interesting story outcomes. He's already a drunk. I'm going to keep the High Lordship though. Oh dear, I hope he does a good job. <laughs> He's representing me all the way up here. Uh, we can negotiate an alliance with my son at least. So let's do that. And we can also modify their contract. I like gold. Oh, I can't do this. 
I can't click on it. Oh, is he's already, he's already waiting to answer my alliance call. I think, right? Greetings, my implacable liege. I'm honoured by your request. Okay, so now can I change your contract? Yeah, I can change his contract now. There we go. Let's go ahead and do this. So my son is going to rule Harren Hall. Doesn't that give us a negative debuff? Or is it only him? Gain some stress, levy size, holding taxes. When King Harren refused to bend the knee to Aegon the Conqueror, he doomed not only himself and his house, but his great fortress as well. Today, Harren Hall lies in ruin. It's stone melted and burned, and yet even as a ruin, Harren Hall is still an impressive and strong holding. Oh, we can upgrade. Oh, that costs... Oh, that's a lot of gold. 8,000 gold. Oh, so this is how we restore Harren Hall. Ah... Every, okay, when I take over as my son, maybe we can spend some gold and start restoring it. And every time succession happens, there we go. So, Torrentine is it. We need to go down here. But I don't think I have any more claims, do I? I don't. Okay. I can demand payment as well. So, let's go ahead and demand some payment. 10 gold from you. Thank you very much. What about from you? Only 3 gold. We'll wait on that one. 50 gold from Lanessa. Thank you very much. <laughs> uh, another 50 gold there. Look how rich we're getting from this. 110 gold. Wowzers. 15. Yeah, and another 50. Yeah, we'll wait for that one. Uh, just like that, we're at 500 gold again. Oh, I like getting hooks. Hooks are incredible. And we've kept this. Oh, we got a smuggling ring, though. My daughter, Nicolette, has just finished a lesson held by Ambrose on the management of the treasury and the gold they're in. But it seems that only the bits mentioning gold have stuck. <laughs> uh, my daughter has become greedy. Okay, Lord Laris, why why are you pinned to Ah, because you slayed my cousin. So do we murder Lord Laris? Let's wait until we deal with this first, I guess. Visiting a local market, a merchant from a faraway land catches my attention. Come closer, my lord. Marvel at treasures never before seen in these lands. I had to watch my back to get these beauties out, I did. Never sleeping with both my eyes closed. The merchants might have more to give than marvels from afar. Do you know what? You're going to tell me what you know. Oh, we gained threatened merchant for five years. Popular opinion. Oh, people hate me. It's because we're slowly changing to intrigue. We have enough gold to invite some more people. Let's go ahead and invite you. That should help the success chance quite a bit. Yeah, there we go. Look at that. Uh, we could even invite you as well. You're the impaler. 150 gold there. That's fine. We're going to teach these guys. In that case, I can cancel this because because we have so much gold, we can just buy our hooks. And then what I'm going to do... Oh, Clifford Baratheon died now as well. Let's go ahead and try and murder Laris. Only a 5% chance. We, yeah, we're on support schemes already. We can invite some people. Let's see. You can be convinced. Let's bribe you. 66 gold. That's fine. You can be convinced as well. 75 gold. There we go. That should help us. The existence of my plot to murder Alana Tyrell has been discovered. While my involvement is not yet known, this will make it a lot more difficult to bring my plans to fruition. Ah, it's gone down to 30%. Oh, dear. It should be fine. We have plenty of gold to invite people. We can actually invite someone now. Emma Florence. Let's invite you. 50 guy, 55 gold for that. Alanor's time has come. All the things fall eventually. Kingdoms, lords, children's pushed from high place. I think we should wait. Let's wait because we're going to invite some more people. We have the gold. There we go. Look, someone else has joined. Uh, we're making plenty of gold. So let's just wait and push this up a little bit. We're getting some prestige as well. Mercenary contract expiring. Uh, yeah, that's okay. We don't need them anymore. So somehow... Do you have a son yet? You have a son. Okay, nice. And he's betrothed off to my cousin. You're not married off yet. She looks evil. She's going to be... There, yeah, look, you can tell intrigue. <laughs> She's going to have some murdering in the future. So, okay, so Nimrod's Dane should be secure. What about Lannis Dane? Oh, yeah, plenty of children. Okay, so it looks like we, we are very much secure on these two kingdoms here. And I'm protecting my liege as well. I don't need factions against my liege. There are a few... But no one's joining them, so that's good. What's popped up here? Uh, we can declare war on Lord Walter. Lord Davos has a claim. 
my uncle on the Lordship of Strongwine. I say we push this. Let's expand Dane's territory. We want to have control of the border of Dawn anyway. So let's go ahead and declare this war. And we'll go and raise the men. Plenty of war on this one. Hopefully this war goes better than the last one. Oh, what? Put some armor on. Oh dear. Eleanor's time has come. Uh, not yet. Soon. In fact, we can invite some more people. How much gold do you want? 150. So let's invite him. That should bump it up a little bit. There we go. 63% chance now. I can call on my house member, Lord Gunther. We, we don't need you, Gunther. But I appreciate the offer. Seven week there days, one week. There we go. Oh, my hook's expired. Oh, she was giving me so much gold. Let's go. Where are we? Is that the war target? That's the war target right here, right? Yeah, here. Okay, so let's go ahead and take the army. We'll, we'll stop this siege first because it should be somewhat of an easy victory. Anyway. I like that banner with the skull and the crown. We gained living healthy for five years. A medium health boost. How healthy am I? We're, we're feeling fine at the age of 61. My daughter can marry off as well. So let's go ahead and send that. Oh, we get an alliance with the high towers now. That's fine. I thought for a moment that was the Tyrells. Uh, we definitely don't want an alliance with them. We want to kill them. If there's one thing Eleanor in particular cannot resist, it's her favorite treat. Are we ready to do this? 63% chance. No, let's just wait a tiny, tiny bit longer. Uh, what we can do is actually just start sieging this down now. Because they're running off anyway. I can demand payments as well, but you're too poor. We can't invite anyone new. We have to wait for the gold. That's fair. Shady Sands is under siege. Is it? I don't think it is. <laughs> they went all the way around. Are they going to attack me as well? My agents have acquired a discreet pack. Should we try to kill him? It's not... Hmm. We have to wait. We have to wait on both of these. We just need to bribe a few more people. It's all fine. Uh, same with you. Let's just wait a little bit longer. There's no rush for this. There is a rush for this war, though. We don't want allies to reinforce. Uh, there we go. We took a prisoner, but then we can't ransom them. Let's go ahead and intercept here. In fact, they do have some people who are some allies joining them. My agent, Darianne, approached me with a bunch of parchment clutching in her hands. I found old architectural sketches of the Lord's Castle. They might be a bit outdated, but look here. Oh, that looks like a tunnel we can use. Let's wait still. <laughs> my daughter Nicolette has been harboring a secret affection for Lord Bennett for some time. However, when she finally confessed her feelings, Bennett responded harsh. Oh, my daughter. If one fails at first, all one can do is try again. She's going to become stubborn. Don't let anyone say no to you, my daughter. You're, you're House Dane after all. You're from House Dane. There we go. We managed to catch up with one of their armies. We managed to kill one of their champions as well. My spy master, Lady Carolee, approached me with a wicked grin. Not yet. <laughs> What I should do. Can we... Okay. Okay, that's 95% chance. So the next time this one pops up, we'll, we'll try that. And get some revenge on the Tyrells. Oh, my cousin died. Died of cancer. And Balos died as well. So who's leading his lands now? You. And we're married to you. Your sister. So I don't think we have an alliance there anymore, which is unfortunate. Okay, we're going to try and murder her. Eleanor is dead. The search went long into the night before it was called off and recovered and reconvened at dawn. It was only then that the body was found bloodied, mangled and torn apart after an attack by some vicious hungry beast. At least I hope it was the beast doing. Thankfully, everyone agrees it is a terrible tragedy and my involvement and the existence of any scheme remains unknown. <laughs> we gain a little bit of stress because she's a child, but we've already got our revenge. Right. Let's get some more revenge. They have another child, so we're going to murder her as well. I need a new spy master because my cousin died, I think. Oh, look at that. My nephew is very good. Lord Cletus of Ferry Bridge. You're going to become my spy master now. We can change your contract as well. You're already paying taxes. Do you know what? Give me more levies as well, then. There we go. That's working for me. 
And we're going to win this battle as well. Beautiful stuff. Ah, oh, you were slain in battle. I don't think he's anyone of significance though. Look at that. We killed four of their champions even. But now we need to catch up to this army. These guys are just too fast for us. They keep fleeing. But maybe they will stay here now because they want to uh, uh, reoccupy their own holding. Yeah, there we go. They're going to stand and fight. We should be able to win this one relatively easily. Oh, my son. He got his... F oh, he was maimed. I thought my son got his first kill. Oh, it's dangerous letting my son fight for us. But if he wants to prove himself, we should allow him. We should wait for this one. Not yet. Soon. We need to save up some gold here and get some invites. So we've won this battle. Killed some of their champions. as well. We still haven't won overall. We need another siege. That's what we need. Look how much. We're, we're generating gold so fast. Well, I could just abandon. Yeah. Do you know what? I'm more focused on the Tyrells right now. My cousin's death. Uh, his immediate family can deal with that. Oh, you would take a bribe. Let's bribe you to join. That should help a lot. I offer Hamana my sincere thanks as she stares angrily at me through a haze of alchemy. It was not easy to find someone to volunteer to test my collection of substances. For her, it has been an evening of pain, burning sensations, and occasional unconsciousness. This has been most insightful. Oh, we're not done yet. <laughs> we're experimenting with poisons. We're not done yet. We gained an intrigue perk as well. Very nice. Hostile scheme success chance. Plus 25%. That's huge. In fact, look at that. We're already on 76% here now. Our revenge is close. In fact, what we can do, if we can have two murder schemes, why not go ahead and murder you as well? There we go. Double the efficiency. All right, my dear friend. I was once again reminded of your victory against Titus, so I decided to write a poem about your triumph, Lanessa says, clearing her throat. A work of poetry. Okay. Uh, through though conflict brings wrath to awesome day, our hero lives to enter the fray. His subjects prove grateful for if they are not, the Sioux seen on which side they have fought. Sure, you know thank you, my friend. I'll keep this poem close. And we gain an artifact as well. I really wish I could equip Dawn. Red prestige and renown. I mean, fertility and prestige is nice. Let's swap out this one and we're going to equip this one. I like prestige and renown. They're always going to be useful. How long until we siege this? 30 days and they have 40 days. We should be able to siege this and then stop them taking this back in time. In fact, we should slow down the... Oh, I might have missed it there. We took a prisoner as well. Can I ransom you? I can. 50 gold. Thank you very much. And we're going to stop this as well. I'm hoping this victory here should actually win us the war. We're very close to winning the war now. And just like that, strong wine will be ours. Greetings, Lord Ulrich of Torrentine. Blessings upon you and your house. You are a much greater foe than I imagined. In order to pull an end to this bloodshed, I will comply with your demands. So be it. <laughs> and just like that, if we go ahead and zoom in, who controls this now? My uncle. His domain is growing. We might have to be worried about him in the future. But more importantly, Torrentine itself is growing. We almost have, if we can get this little bit of land here, uh, and then we almost secured the border. Let's go ahead and change his contract as well, because we do have a hook on him. So in the next episode, I think we'll maybe look at this. But we could also look at trying to expand our land in the north too. Don't forget, we have Harrenhal now. Uh, it's going to be something... To, to think about. But that's it for today, guys. Uh, I'm quite exhausted and hot, if you couldn't tell. <laughs> the problem is we're, with this heat and humidity, uh, I have to keep everything closed to record. Uh, and if you know the UK, we don't do aircon here. So the PC heats up this room very, very fast. Uh, which is why I haven't been streaming lately as well. It's, it's been very difficult to find time to record. And when you couple with that with hay fever as well, it's uh, I've been feeling a little bit drained i guess but that's it for today if you liked the video and you want to see more be sure to press the like button we'll be back tomorrow hopefully now we'll be back tomorrow it's fine back on the daily uploads but that's it for today i'll see you next time